One area of High Point is looking to become a social district. Uptown has new businesses moving in and those already there are expanding, but there is one thing holding them back a crosswalk. Good evening. Welcome to the Fox 8 5 o'clock news. I'm Katie Nordine and I'm Neil McNeil. Fox 8 Sarah Winkleman joins us now live along North Main Street in High Point. Sarah, what changes are they hoping to make to that crosswalk? Neil and Katie, they want to make this area safer right now. The way that it works is you go up, push the button. Those yellow lights will flash and then you can cross the road. But we're hearing that it takes a while. And even myself, when I went to go cross this street earlier, it took several cars before somebody stopped and then the rest of the lane slowly followed after that. And that is a reoccurring theme in this area as people are walking across the street and going over in this area to access these businesses and grab some food and drink. We're hoping to create a social district here. Walkability is key and safety is key. Wesley Hudson is the mayor pro tem in High Point and is heading up the committee trying to bring traffic changes to North Main Street. What we're hoping for is a push button activated red stoplight so that all traffic is stopped on all four lanes. We're also looking at adding some medians, uh, possibly some crossing islands for pedestrians. The main focus is to prevent injuries while trying to cross busy North Main Street. I have seen a few automobile accidents. I've seen an accident involving a pedestrian, which was pretty intense to say the least, and I don't want to see one again. Chris Bradley owns artistic apparel and often crosses the street to meet with customers and have lunch. Honestly, most time I'll just get in my car and drive across because I don't want to take a chance. And he isn't alone. It can be a hazardous affair. Michael Robinson works at Brown Truck Brewery and has seen the same issues. He also says since the parking lot fills up fast, that makes it even worse. And although there are other places to park uh, in the surrounding areas, if you can't cross the street to get here, then that can cause a potential problem. Brown Truck Brewery purchased the former Furniture Finds building next door and plans to open later this year. But they say traffic solutions are crucial to their success. You can definitely see a lot of potential in the future. And this street is owned by the DOT. So the next step in this process will be for the city to submit their proposal to the NCDOT. And then they will look that over, do their assessment before any changes are in place. And that process could take a while and it could be over a year before we see any changes out here at this crosswalk on North Main Street. Live in High Point, Sarah Winkleman, Fox 8 News.